Kemper. Uh, you are aware, I am sure, of the recent Supreme Court decision. Uh, we are today filing for rehearing uh, with the court, uh, asking them to reconsider their decision. It was a very close decision, five to four. We were disappointed uh, by the decision because we are absolutely convinced that it is not in the best interest of our customers. Uh, it will, over the period of what we had hoped would be uh, stable rates and lower rates than would otherwise be, it will cause rates to be higher and to be considerably higher, and that is not a good thing. The basis, the primary basis upon which the Supreme Court reversed uh, the uh, order of the Commission uh, are matters that are outside the subject of the appeal that was filed by Thomas Blanton. The court ignored, uh, did not in any way address uh, the authorization of the Public Utility Act, and we think the Public Utility Act uh, very, very clearly authorizes uh, the recovery of mere quip. Um, that's, the, that's the primary uh, basis uh, upon which uh, we're asking them to rehear is to look at the Public Utility Act, uh, look at the authorization uh, that it provides, and find that indeed Miraquip is authorized and that the refund should not occur. If, if you would review this, uh, it would be obvious that the increase is not two, four to six. The increase is actually four to six uh, because the, the two, four that you hear about is what we estimated the, the gasifier, the gas cleanup, and the combined cycle would cost. Not included in that 2-4 number, but known, obviously, by everyone at the Commission uh, and others who were involved, is that in order for this plant to run, you've got to have a lignite mine, you've got to have a CO2 pipeline that will take the CO2 that you are producing and selling for enhanced oil recovery. There's a list of items that are what we call uncapped items that in four Commission orders very clearly are authorized to be approved. We we just we just chosen not to make because not to make a big deal out of the error, so to speak. Um, frankly, it is the reporting in the Supreme Court opinion uh, that said that we were they used the same numbers that you have used, uh, and that has been the catalyst more than anything for us wanting to get the record straight and correct it. Hindsight again, 2020, we probably should have done that 